Hey everybody, hope you're having a great day. We're here with the Toronto Real Estate Board statistics that have now just come out for July. So pretty much the same story all the time, but I'll go over it again this month. It's a bit of a repeat from the last couple of months. Let's talk first about sales volume. And here we did see a bit of an increase for the first time in a few months. 3.3% more sales happened in this July compared to the one previous. And that is, I mean, good in a way. We do see slightly more buyers out there. I'm definitely feeling it actually in the last couple of weeks. So we'll see how that transpires for the next couple of months. Uh, however, we also have way more new listings, 18.5% in fact, over uh, this time last year. That's obviously a lot, um, especially in the condo space. Every day I'm seeing hundreds of new listings being entered there and um, a lot are coming off the market and not selling at all. So let's talk a little bit about average price. We have an average price of $1,106,617. Now that is down slightly from last year of 0.9%. Not too bad considering. Uh, when we break that out, we've got an average price in the 416 of a detached of 1.4648, sorry. And that is actually up half a percent from last year. And in the 905, 1.363, which is down 1%. So the detached market, pretty flat. So not too, not too badly there, whether you're in the 416 or the 905. And same thing with condos, 748,000 and change was the average price for a condo in the 416. And that is also down half a percent from last year. So when we're looking at these numbers, I do always have to caution you, keep in mind there's a whole bunch of stuff here that we don't see and don't report on. Expireds, terminateds, um, you know, ones that are, are have undergone a number of price changes up and down and then finally sell at one price. Well, those may have been uh, new listings and so we don't actually see that get compiled in the data here. So anyway, all in all, I would say not bad considering. Uh, as I mentioned, I do see a little bit of an uptick in interest, let's call it, over the last couple of weeks. So I'm anxious to see what the stats will be like for August. In the meantime, feel free to reach out. As always, I hope you have a great day. And don't forget to follow our podcast, The Toronto Real Estate, St Real Estate Show with Janelle and Leslie. And you can find that, of course, on Apple Podcasts or Spotify. Have a good one, and we'll see you soon.